Hi everyone, in this video, I'm going to solve a nice algebraic equation. The equation we have minus seven to the power of k is equal to seven. Here we are going to find out the value of k. So let's start our solution. And the first step, I'm going to write this minus seven in this form, minus one times seven whole to the power of k is equals to seven. Now we're going to use the exponential rule that is a times b whole to the power of m can be written as a to the power of m times a to the power of m. So this will be turned to minus one whole to the power of k times seven to the power of k is equals to seven. Now, next, I'm going to use the user's identity in trichromatic ratio form. So, that is e to the power of iota pi plus 1 is equal to 0. And this can be written as e to the power of i pi is equal to negative 1. Now, in replacement of this negative 1, I'm going to write this e to the power of iota pi. So this equation turns to e to the power of i pi holds the power of k times 7 to the power of k is equals to 7. Now I am going to use the exponential rule that is a to the power of m and o to the power of m is equal to a to the power of m times n. So this will be turned to in this form. So e to the power of iota k pi times 7 to the power of k is equal to 7. Now we're going to take log for the side here. Log e to the power of iota k pi times 7 to the power of k bracket close is equal to now here I'm going to apply the logarithm rule that is log of a times b can be written as log of a plus log of b. Therefore, this equation turns to log of e iota k pi log of 7 to the power of k is equal to log of 7. Now, I'm going to use the logarithm property here, that is log of a to the power of b is equal to b log of a. So, I'm going to apply this here and here. So, this equation turns to the power we have iota k pi log of e plus k log of 7 is equal to log of 7. Now we have the logarithm rule. The log of e is equal to 1. So I'm going to write here 1. So it will turn to i k pi plus k log of 7 is equal to log of 7. Now here I will going to take the common of k, k bracket i pi plus log of 7 is equal to log of 7. Now our aim is to find out the value of k. So I will going to, here this is multiplying, so it will be going to be divided on this side. So the expression we will get after dividing here is iota pi plus log of 7. So this is our k value that we find out from the user identity. Now we're going to solve this same expression by using the another method. The second method we have, the expression we have minus 7 to the power of k is equals to 7. Now we're going to express this in this form minus 1 times 7 whole to the power of k is equals to 7. 
Now, as you know that root minus one is equals to i. And here I am going to write the value of negative one. So for that, I want to remove this root. So I'm going to take the square root this side here. So here this will be equals to iota square is equals to negative one. So I was going to write here in replacement of negative one iota square times seven and whole to the power of k is equals to seven. Now again I was going to use the same algebraic identity that uh, have the different bases, but we have the same power. So iota square and whole to the power of k times seven to the power of k is equal to seven. We're going to use the law of indices that uh, I used before. So I'm going to multiply the powers here. So i to the power of two k times seven to the power of k is equal to seven. Now I'm going to take log with the side here. So iota to the power of k times seven to the power of k equals to log of seven. Now we're going to write this log iota raised to the power of two k times log seven to the power of k is equals to log of seven. Now I was going to use the logarithm rule that I used before. So this will turn to 2k log of i plus k log of 7 is equals to log of 7. Now we're going to take common here of k. Here k bracket 2 log of i plus log of 7 bracket close is equals to log of 7. Now here this expression is multiplying with the k, so I'm going to write this in this form k is equals to log of 7 over 2 log of i plus log of 7. So this is another way to find out the value of k. So thank you so very much for watching my video. If you like my video, please do subscribe to my channel.